Hello and welcome to my video. My name is Hilary Queen. They also call me the Queen of Interiors and Architecture. In today's video, I will be showing you how to tie these three ribbon styles. So stay tuned and let's get right into it. For the first style, we're going to need to make sure that our ribbon is cut already to the right length. And we're just going to tie it in the middle and put it right to the side because we'll need it for later. Now we're going to be tying the main ribbon that will be placed right on top. Make sure that all four loops are on either side. So that's what I'm doing right now. I am folding them, making sure that they're evenly all on one side and putting them together, ensuring that they're all accurately on top of each other now what you're gonna do is get scissors and cut them parallel from each other like so make sure it's done either side really small slits um, and now we're gonna grab the box if the tie was undone we can tie it again um, and place it right in the middle of that tie so now we're just going to tie the, the ribbon right in the middle, like so. Make sure it's really tight and in the middle. And now what we're going to do is the funnest part, which is now adjusting them, making them look even. Sometimes the pattern might be on the opposite side, so what I'm doing is making sure that they can sh um, I turn them around so they can they can be seen so I'm just having fun with it adjusting them and moving them around make sure that they're evenly distributed on either side and I got my scissors to now finally cut the ends make sure that you pick the right length um, so you just fold them in the middle and then cut it to create this really pretty length I decided that I preferred them shorter so I cut them shorter and do that to both sides And this is a really, really simple design, but it's really, really effective because the ribbon looks really intricate and beautiful. So that would be one of my favorite designs. Now for the second style, we're gonna, again, make sure the ribbon is cut to the right size. I'm using my favorite ribbon, which is this thick, beautiful red ribbon just like the one I used for the first style and I am going to now um, wrap it around the box making sure that it fits you will just need to tie it right in the middle like so and then tie it round and then loop it over your finger and then in through the whole make sure it the pattern is evenly um, visible in either side and now I'm just adjusting it to the desired size the box is quite large it's relatively medium size actually so, so there you have it really simple um, highly effective as well and it's also one of my favorites. Now moving over to the next style. This one we'll be using thinner ribbon. Um, this ribbon we're gonna wrap it at, 
at the bottom and then all the way around to the front and we're going to tie it at the middle. Make sure you measure the length of the gift before you cut so you know how much you're going to need. Here I'm just making sure that the, the shiny side is showing on the ribbon and not the matte side. Here I'm just tying a normal um, bow in the middle, very similar to the second style. And this, I also bought a pre-made ribbon that I'm going to attach on top um, for the final finish. So here I'm just adjusting the ribbon and I'm here I'm now curling the ends. This is another tip that's that I actually learned from my grandmother and it's getting a scissor and just scraping it slightly on the ends and it produces these really pretty curls. Don't do it too hard or the ribbon might cut. So make sure you're doing it really, really lightly. So now the final look very simple, you've got your beautiful curls um, on the ends and it's highly effective and also one of my favourites. That's it ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this video. These are now the three styles all together. If you have made it all the way to the end, I'd love it if you can subscribe and like this video and I'll see you in the next video where I We'll probably be talking to you about more fun tips, DIY tricks, so stay tuned. I post weekly, so I love you all and see you in the next video. Bye!